welcome in to Building Creative Bridges, where we like to build bridges between the watcher and the creator, and creators and other creators. If you are a creator and you would like a shout out on an upcoming shout out Building Creative Bridges video, please get a hold of me at this email address, lisaladybird at googlemail.com. And I will say what you need me to say. Let us know why we should come and subscribe to you, what you've got going on, anything special happening. Maybe you just have a goal in mind. Let us know and I will give you a shout out. Now, first off, we have Smile Club. Smile Club for April features somebody over in the UK. Now, I am able to say to you that this person is a Yarny, and that's all I'm telling you here. Um, if you are willing to send somebody a little bit of something over to the UK to give them a little bit of a boost, some motivation, let them know that they're not alone, give them a, a little bit of warmth, whether that be something handmade, whether that be a card, something off of Etsy or Amazon, however you want to, however you can, if you can, please send me an email and I will give you the details that I can about this particular person. Always nice to spread a little bit of love. Talking of spreading love, let's do some shout out love and the first person being Kaylin who is officially Kay's Crochet Haven yes she has her own website now Shh. this is now her business she is a monetized as of this week and she has now been on YouTube for two years and is going to be celebrating with us all. New things coming in on her channel, as well as an ongoing cal that she's doing with two other creators. There are hauls, the odd happy mail here and there, whips, a lot of foes, and there is the odd live, usually on a Thursday. She also takes part in the vlog months, so stay tuned. And as anybody in these shout outs um, that you might like to go and take a look at, their link is in the description below. If your device doesn't like the link, their name is written exactly as it is in YouTube. So all you need to do is copy and paste it into the search at the top of YouTube and hopefully as you can see their picture here you will be able to find the right channel. Okay that was Miss Kaylin. Next up we have Rosalie over at Yarn It Out. Now she is doing a very unique style giveaway. She is looking for Yarny anecdotes, maybe poems, Maybe a story about the first time that you learnt, who taught you, something that is stuck in your mind that is Yarny related. But I'm not going to go into too much detail. Miss Rosalie um, is hosting with whips and foes and tutorials, not just your standard stitch tutorials, actual knowledge of yarn and crochet. Um, she has her hauls and she has vlogs and the odd other little bit here and there and she has a very contagious little laugh. Miss Rosalie is looking for you. Are you looking for Rosalie? Go and have a look. As with all shout out people, I don't tell you to subscribe. What I will say is go over and if you like something, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you wish to. We all appreciate it, all of us. And if you particularly like something, let the creator know because comments and the thumbs help 
a channel grow because it helps YouTube to say, okay, people seem to like this. Let's shout it out a little bit more. And it helps build the channels. So please help those that you like, thumb often, comment often, and we can all grow and be happy. Okay, last shout out for today. Well, what would building creative bridges be if there wasn't a the bra? Crochet life and stuff with Deborah. She says, are you my Crystal the Yarny Chicken and Crazy Cat Lady semi-finalist? Did you win one of the awesome seasonings from Miller's Savory? Did I ever get the hubby blanket finished? How many whips should I have? Will I ever remember to count my stitches? Is there such a thing as too much yarn? What exactly is magical poop? The answers to these questions and more can be found over at Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah. What more can I say? That about sums it up. <laughs> uh, so there we have three Yarny ladies. Um, if you'd like to go and check them out, you know what to do. You have my email address and it's always in the description down below if you need to get a hold of me. Either way, hopefully we'll see you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.